Fit by first, day six, six, seven, 20 a.m. and I'm headed to the gym. Uh, I have a cold or something, sore throat, not feeling great, didn't sleep well last night, not breathing too good. So yeah, we will have fun today doing this dumb workout. See you afterwards. Seven rounds, 20 jumping jacks, five push-ups, 10 this jump squats, completed. Vomited, will ensue, but so will breakfast, and that's the hope. The hope is it's dumb eggs. Them eggs, though. Yeah, it's a tough workout. A little post workout, Phil Collins. Woo! Oh Lord, oh Lord, I can feel it coming in the air tonight. Oh Lord. So, um,. Today's been a good day, did some running around with my wife. I got to cook some steak for dinner, ate a salad for lunch. Family lunch at the firehouse, got a salad. Looks pretty good. It tastes pretty good too, we've already eaten some of it. So. And there's my wife. She's not hiding. Got them eggs in for breakfast, so just all around a good day. Um, spent a good amount of time with my lady love shopping for the house, doing some things for the kids. Moved my little girl, my, our middle child, up to a big girl twin size bed, which is a big moment. And uh, so yeah, just a good day. Um, really enjoying my family, enjoying being active again for Fit by First. Um, looking forward to finishing up, finishing strong. Only 24 more days and then Fit by First will be over. So, um, yeah. Wanted to give a shout out to my buddy Steve, Steve Swartz, um, who said he's been watching the vlog and trying to keep up with it. I appreciate that. I appreciate all of you guys that are watching it. And uh, just wanted you to know that it's it, it goes noticed, that it means a lot. Um, it means um, someone's interested in my story and you know it may not be um, the most dramatic or anything like that, but um, it's great to have encouragement, to have people watching and, and just saying, hey, keep it up. Um, so thank you so much for your encouragement. Um, one thing from today that was really um, neat is that, um, and I talked about it in the clip from my post-workout, is that just the opportunity to encourage um, somebody and be on the side of experience versus kind of the rookie um, whereas I I did fit by first in December and I was the rookie back then and I really needed the help to get going and today I got to kind of give back so um, to say hey you can do it you can push through and get there so um, just want to encourage anybody out there that if one maybe you're doing something for the first time um, you can do it push through no matter what it is doesn't matter if you are working out for the first time or if you are you know trying to go to college or better your life or, or whatever it may be um, stick with it persevere and push through because you can do it you can give more than you think you're able to um, if you are on the side of experience and you have something to offer offer it don't be afraid to speak up when someone needs encouragement don't be afraid to impart your wisdom or your experience or your um, the things that you know and understand to help somebody reach and accomplish their goals. I think we all could do a better job just as human beings lending ourselves to the aid of others so that um, they will be ready and built up to accomplish the things that they have ahead of them, whether they're a Christian or not, whether they are um, you know, your friend or not. You never know when a kind word, an encouraging word, or um, when someone needs that so just wanted to throw that out there and say that hey you are able to give kind words and encouragement we're all able to do it so look for a way that you can do that this week I certainly will be looking for those opportunities 
um, continue to follow me on this vlog go and check out my friends the Carolinos on their vlog go to YouTube type in vlogalino I'll even try to remember to post the link down below um, thanks for stopping by hope you guys have a great Tuesday and I will see you tomorrow